Good morning, YouTube. It's Rochelle from EJ's Daughter. Today is Sunday, May 17th, 2020, and I'm just going to spend a few minutes with you today just to show you what I've been working on, what I've been doing. First off, I uh, hope everyone is staying safe and staying safe. So let's jump into it. I've been making dish towels, dish cloths for the past couple of weeks, and so this is one I started last night, and it's all bunched up, but it's knitted. I want to try the Ross pattern. Uh, smell great guy. Smells like yarn. Ross has a pattern, has several patterns that I want to try, but I'm not ready yet. So I'm just doing a basic uh, garter stitch, but I put a rib stitch, a pearl stitch right in here. And you can't really see it because of the yarn. And this is a size 10 uh, needle. So I am working on that. And I'm going to be all over the place this morning. Here is a bag that I made a couple years ago to keep um, little small doodads and stuff in it. I've got needles in here, I've got a small pair of scissors. So I just throw this in my project bag when I need my um, my notions. And I make my own project bags too, so I'm gonna show you one of those. This is one of my project bags that I make, made. It's huge, it's probably one of the biggest that I have. And in here, I have, um, scrubby yarn and I have cotton cotton yarns also in here different types of cotton yarns so I have been making um, face scrubbies and dish scrubbies so I just keep that in here while I'm working on it so here is a scrubby and here is another scrubby and I don't know if it's the scrubby stuff but this one is actually softer than this one. I don't know if it's my hook size, but I think I did change my hook size. I'm not sure. But anyway, two scrubbies. I found this pattern called Clean Sweep. And so it's a dish towel or it's a cleaning cloth. And so I crocheted this in purple and gold. And then I crocheted this one and I couldn't decide... I made it so tight, you can see it's tight, but I couldn't decide how I wanted to uh, put the petals around it. So I decided to do three double crochet and two chains all the way around. So it made for a different ending, which I like. And then here's another one that I made. It's a, I used a larger hook. I think I used a J, um, J hook. Cause I rarely use the size hook that the, the ball band says use. So I think I used a J and this is the way it's kind of sort of should look. And this is uh, premier cotton Valentine with, I think some hot pink. And then here's the Valentine again. And then this one is just regular, regular um, cotton, premier cotton, just regular double crochet. And then here's another one that's just double crochet. And then I knitted this one with black and purple put together. And then this is also one just purple that I put together. This is a black one. Just knit it. And then here's purple and black. And I just, whatever, what when I was working on the purple and I ran out and I thought, you know what, just slap some black with it. And that's what I did. So there's that. I have three other things to show you. And then, no, one of the four. This is another bag that I made. This is from um, Old Lab Coats. And so you can see I used the side with the pocket. And then here's the other pocket. And I use twill tape for the handle, but I don't carry it anyway anywhere because this just holds my measuring tapes and as you can see I've got it lined in there and I just use it to hold measuring tapes so it just stays by my chair so when I need to measure something it is right there front and center now three other things I need to show you and then we'll end this video so I've been making and carried in my little bowl here I've been making scarves move some of this stuff out of the way Okay, this one is um, Hobby Lobby. I think it's a yarn bee. I think it's a yarn bee um, yarn. 
But anyway, I made it. I really like this one. This I know was yarn B that I mixed with black. And it's double the size, but I, I'm not unfolding all of it. So you can see that. And then this one, I bought some Burnett Chunky from um, the thrift store. And I crocheted a cowl with it. And this is just like a gray. This is just a heather gray, my gray, which I really like. And I've got three and a half skeins left of this, and I'm going to make a hat and maybe another scarf with this, okay? Oh, and since this is showing, I'll pick this up and show it to you. This is my little small purple sewing machine um, that I use. It's my Purple Thunder. I've had this since 2014, I think, and as you can see, I've got two inch, two and a half inch squares that I've been sewing. Uh, I like it, but it's very noisy and it's slow, but I still like it, I still use it. So there's that. Okay, that's all I got for right now. Uh, everyone have a great day. Stay safe. Talk to you soon. Bye.